do you realize that if the sun refuses to be made available it bears no evidence of light a plant itself cannot survive if you have done basic biology you realize that plant feed upon what we call photosynthesis until plant itself behold light if you plant a plant here now it will grow to the degree of the exposition of light that means even plant itself is handicapped with that light and you and I feed upon plants animals feed upon plants so that you can survive believe it believe it but like I said tonight my charge is in line with chance giving second Corinthians 2 14 second Corinthians you should be tired of this scripture by now but never be tired of it thank you so much for everything you do I mean imagine everybody have to travel back the, the, the break was not that much though. the break was just like two weeks later I sat down I checked when did we go on break I discovered it was all a lie there was no break <laughs> some of us that we went about it to break there was no break I'm as tired as I was last year but I'm ready I don't know about you some of you went and slept and snore. We didn't do that. They prepared for us by miracle service. Okay. Second Corinthians 2 14. Let me read my own media. The Bible said, Thanks now, thanks be unto God, which has caused us to triumph always in Christ Jesus. And made manifest the server of his knowledge by us in every place. Now thanks be to God, which causes us to triumph in Christ Jesus. Thanks be to God, which causes us to triumph in Christ Jesus. Your triumph in life is upon a thanksgiving to the Lord. There is a weapon of advancement referred to as thanksgiving. A weapon of multiplication, a weapon of elevation referred to as thanksgiving. Like I've always said, we don't thank God because of what He has done, we actually thank Him for what He will do. If you can truly have a reason to pray, you should have a reason to thank God. If there is something you are trusting God for and you are praying to God about, you should also turn it as a thanksgiving to the Lord. The truth is that I have studied through scripture and anytime Jesus wants to make a request from the Father, Abba, he always thanks him. Thank you, Father, because before I pray, you hear me. I know you have an infirmity, you have a sickness. Doctors have made a report for you this year. This year, you are going to be dwelling upon drugs. Can you thank the Lord for the report of the doctors? Not because you agree with it, but because you believe by faith that it is changed. Now, thanks be to God which causes us to triumph in Christ Jesus and he make manifest the sorrow of his presence the Bible speaking in the book of Psalms 95 from 2 he said let us come before his presence with thanksgiving and make a joyful noise unto him with psalms anytime you appear before the presence of God you must come with thanksgiving come with gratitude tell him I'm grateful there is always a strength hidden in the weakness and the infirmity of men that only thanksgiving can reveal. In the days when you cannot pray, you cannot fast, at least thank the Lord. It may cost you nothing. In the day when you are in a midst where everything is denied of you, of spiritual advancement, in the day you cannot engage any mystery, at least wake up and say, Father, thank you. Bible speaking in the book of Philippians 4 says, say be careful for nothing but in everything by prayer and supplication. He now said this thing must be done what? With thanksgiving. Let your request be made known unto God. Be careful for nothing but in everything by prayer and by supplication. He now said with thanksgiving. There is a key, a vehicle where which our prayer 
and our supplication can be accepted before the Lord. Be careful for nothing, then start praying. Good. But the Bible said there is another kind of key. That if you are not careful for nothing, no problem. By prayer, by supplication, add it together with thanksgiving. Let now this your request be made known unto God. It then means that it's possible for us to be praying to the Lord, supplicating to the Lord, and just because we have not added thanksgiving to it, the Lord may be silent. 